All right. So the other thing I want you to explore today is that um, the Newsies were from all over New York, right? There were five different boroughs at least that they could have been from. Uh, so let's go ahead and play with the difference between Queens, Manhattan, and the Bronx. Yeah, so it all just has to do with the placement of your voice. Where is your voice coming from uh, as your character? So if I'm from Queens, I'm going to actually have my voice. Um, it's going to be very nasal, almost very high pitched. It's going to come from here, right? Versus if I'm from the Bronx, like Spot Conlin and his gang, who's from Brooklyn, which is another neighboring borough, um, then my voice might actually come from the back the back of my head. Yeah, it might come from back here. So let's play a game. We're going to count from one to 10 to find that really forward nasal Queens placement. And then we're going to count from 10 to one to find that really far back Bronx, you know, New York Bronx placement. All right. So here we go. Do this with me. We're going to count from one to 10, getting as we're more and more forward with your resonance as we go. Here we go. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, so here I am. Hi, I'm a newsie and I'm from Queens. Yeah, hi, how are you? Good. All right, so now I'm going to reverse it. I'm going to start in the middle of my mouth, which, um, uh, might be uh, if I'm from Manhattan, yeah, which is most of our Manhattan newsies, they spoke uh, kind of from the middle of their mouth. So it's very direct. It's very fast paced in Manhattan. You know, I got to sell this pape. Um, I got to get to Pulitzer to, to tell him what's up. You know, I really, I have a purpose. I have a mission. I got somewhere I got to do uh, something I got to do and somewhere I got to be. So I'm very direct and I, I don't have a lot of time to waste on, um, on silly nonsense. Yeah. So Manhattan, very in the middle of the mouth. Um, but then Bronx, we're going to move further back in the mouth to find that Bronx placement. All right, here we go. We're going to start with 10 and count backwards to one to find that back. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right, so here I am. I'm from New York. Yeah, Newsies. The newsies need our help today. Yeah, so I'm all the way back here. I'm from the Bronx, or maybe I'm even from from you know kind of Brooklyn area. I'm uh I'm yeah back here. Um, so you choose which resonance you want to play with. If you want to be Queens, if you want to be the Bronx, or if you just want to be that happy medium, that Manhattan. I got a purpose. I got somewhere to be, and I got something to say. Uh, but we're gonna finish this video with a couple practice phrases for you. So the first one, the name of the song that Jack Kelly sings at the very beginning of the show, it's called Santa Fe. Well, Jack Kelly doesn't say Santa. What does he say? He says, Santa, Santa. He dreams about Santa Fe. Awesome. Uh, so the Newsies also talk a lot about carrying the banner. So a Newsie is going to drop that final G at the end of carrying and the final R at the end of banner. So they're going to say, carry in the banner, carry in the banner. Awesome. So uh, there's also a whole number, a very fancy tap dance number that has to do uh, with uh, them deciding that they are the kings of New York. So a Newsie would say, I'm the king of New York, new. New. That's that lip rounding again. I'm the king of New York. And I might even drop that R in York. Good. Uh, so the last phrase I'm going to teach you, uh, this is uh, feels relevant to where we are today. Uh, I know that we're all in this together, this COVID-19 crisis and craziness. Um, but the Newsies often would say, uh, one for all and all for one. Yeah, so there's a linking R, one for raw. I'm going to link that R at the beginning of all. One for raw, yeah. And then I'm going to say, and all for one. So why don't I link for one? Because even though 
One starts with a vowel. The sound is actually a W, 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 one, which is a consonant, technically a consonant sound. So I have to drop the R at the end of four and then go into one. So here we go. It's one for raw and all for one. All right, everyone. I hope that you enjoyed your Newsy speak. Uh, feel free to practice with your friends or family over Zoom or Skype or any of those virtual uh, uh, services you might be using, even over the good old fashioned telephone. But uh, I hope you had fun. I hope you learned something. And I can't wait to see you in person at Arena Stage when we're all on the other side of this. All right, stay safe. Bye.